What's going on guys? We are back for the fourth episode of the Star Wars Squadron campaigns. <clears throat> oh, here's Beep Boop Dog. Oh, he's so cute. Alright, let's see. Um, I'm playing a bit of the multiplayer. The multiplayer is uh, actually the intense. The Empire won't push into our territory again anytime soon. Thanks to our new pilot. Yeah, and thanks to the rest of us. This isn't a race, all right? We're a team. You're right, Gunny. But still, nice flying out there. Speaking of fancy flying, I was thinking about the Dragon Void run from a few years back. You see that one, Keo? Oh, sure. I caught the whole thing on the hollow net. Yeah, me too. I watched the entire thing, but for the life of me, I can't recall who won. I think it was one of the Ash Twins. No, wait. Delon Vuce. Yeah, that's it. Boy, he was something else back then. In fact, the only pilot I've seen that comes close since is Keo here. Oh, come on. Delon Vuke's got nine championships under his belt. I've only got five. Well, fun as this is, Commander Javes has someone special waiting for us in the briefing room. Let's get in there and find out what's next. Do you think they're, um... Commander's waiting. Do you think they're oh, gay? Just a thought. So where is it now? I helped Talus Group chase it away from a medical convoy towards Yavin. It's pinned in the upper atmosphere with no hyperdrive, but too many fighters for Talus Group to handle alone. This might work out for both of us. Come, meet our visitor. Wedge Antilles, Rogue Squadron. I hear you're the reason I was able to finally get a calm through. I have a Star Destroyer problem that Vanguard might be able to help me solve. We need a Star Destroyer for Project Starhawk, intact. Now we prove what Vanguard's made of. Wedge, if you would. As you may have overheard, Talos Group has cornered the Imperial Star Destroyer Victorum, above the planet Yavin. They're in tough, but it's presented a great opportunity for us to jump in and not only disable that Star Destroyer, but to seize control. So first, we need to give ourselves some cover by knocking out the turrets. Naturally, if we can also take out the targeting system, that'll buy us even more time. Next, we need to prepare the Star Destroyer for boarding. You'll need to find a potential breach point in the Victorum's hull, preferably near the bridge. Once you find a good spot, bombard it until the hull is breached. However, we can expect that the Victorum still has plenty of TIE fighters. They will try to stop us. Once the skies are clear, we can bring in the boarding team. While our troops capture the bridge, Vanguard will defend the exterior from reinforcements. Once the boarding team has seized the bridge and is in control of the Star Destroyer, we will rendezvous with the Temperance. Okay, I think I accidentally made stealing a Star Destroyer sound simple. Let's hope it is. All right, um, suppose we actually talk to this guy. I think this guy was in the, wasn't he in Star Wars uh, Rogue One? I don't Sorry remember. for the speedy introduction, but Talus Group was counting on me to get reinforcements fast. Your commander says you have talent, enough to steal a Star Destroyer and get away with it. Normally, I'd have Rogue Squadron for this, but General Sindula gave me a temporary assignment to Project Starhawk. Meanwhile, Rogue is handling, well, that's classified too. General Sindula keeps us busy. Your commander and I have something in common. I once flew for the Empire too, at Skystrike Academy. Turning to the Rebellion was the smartest move I ever made. I wish more of my friends had done the same. Look, I appreciate the talk, but uh, Talus Group's waiting for us. Yeah, I, I thought Wedge was in one of the Star Wars. I don't remember. Maybe not. No, wait a minute. That's yeah, yeah, yeah. Wedge. Okay, I uh, I think he was in um, he was in one of the uh, the originals. I I don't remember, dude. Let's just fucking keep this going, I guess. A Star Destroyer? Aren't you tossing him in the deep end a little early, Lyndon? Vanguard can handle it, can't you? Besides. 
Project Starhawk needs that Star Destroyer for... Well, you know. Wedge made a name for himself at the Battle of Yavin. He knows that system better than the Empire ever will. You'll be fighting on the Rebellion's old turf. So if Wedge has any advice, he'd be smart to listen. You know, a wounded Krakana can still fight. Just watch yourself around that Star Destroyer, huh? Get out there as soon as you can. Why is all, like, the fish guys, like, the leaders? I don't know. So, we're headed to Yavin. An exalted company, it seems. And now we know Project Starhawk needs an Imperial Star Destroyer. That's enough firepower to tackle a small fleet, or a means to catch the Empire off guard. But that wouldn't warrant all this secrecy. There must be more to the Commander's plan. We'll just have to trust him. Too bad there isn't an easier way to get what we need. Even a damaged Star Destroyer has deck upon deck of Durasteel plating, turrets, shields. My poor, bigoted father called Star Destroyers the fists of the Empire. He wasn't wrong. But they can be beaten. If you're good and lucky. Let's stay optimistic. To Yavin, then. Let's not delay. So I don't know if... Oh, let's inspect the ship. Okay. Uh, I don't know if you guys ever played Star Wars Battlefront the Commander 2. Commander wants you on an X-Wing for this mission. Got you outfitted with ion missiles. They disable enemy fighters, and they'll disable subsystems on enemy capital ships, too. Okay. I don't know if you guys remember um, the Star Wars Battlefront 2, but um, I was really thinking that the like flying the planes would be like Battlefront 2, the old one, um, or the spaceships. But it's not. It's actually like a lot more different. Um, I kind of like this though. This is a really good. It's a really good like concept how EA made this. Oh, here Yavin we go. Alright. This place always brings back memories. Oh, shit, looks like there's already Let's hope for some going. of that Skywalker luck today. Come on, Wedge. Alright. Ready, Vanguard? We're heading for the heart of the action. Vanguard, follow his lead. Yeah, I remember Wedge was in Wedge was in um Captain Antilles with Vanguard Squadron. Here to help. Wedge was in. Good to see you, Wedge. <sighs> Dude, they keep interrupting me, and it's starting to really piss start. me off. Don't you worry. We're here to hijack it. You're what? Be ready. Yeah, so Wedge was in the original the one. Go. Agreed. They're fast. They'll rip right through our fighters. Vanguard, prioritize targets. Here we go, dog. <laughs> So much concentration. I'm just trying to. Yep, we're hit. Oh shit! Dude, we're gonna blow up. We're gonna blow up. We're gonna blow up. Yikes! Watch your back. Oh, I gotta heal, dude. I can't heal. Get my ass eaten. Fuck it. See you later. Oh. Don't stay in the clouds too long. Even this high up, the heat's gonna strip your hull. Got him. Where's the other guy? There he 
is. That's it. All ties down. Hell Jump yeah. Alright. Okay, regroup on Talos leader. Yikes. We need to make a few repairs, then get ourselves out of here. Roger that, Talos leader. And don't worry about the Imperials. We'll keep them busy. You're really gonna steal that Star Destroyer? That's the plan. You got Dark Demon Girls? On me. Let's head for the Victorum. Yeah, this mission is actually pretty good. Focus your shields before they open fire on us. Back shields, front shields. Hold C to open the shield focus selector. Oh, dude, I didn't know you could do that. That's kind of dope. Let's do it. Deal minimum hull damage, but they're not ideal for squad attacks. Use them to disable enemy starfighters, leaving them adrift and easy to target. Ion weapons are also perfect tool for stripping enemy shields and disabling. Okay, cool. Yeah, this thing still has teeth. Yeah, dog, I shot my eye. No, yeah, dog, give me more. Took a beating just chasing it here. I wanted to see the Victorian go up in flames, but stealing it. <laughs> I like that even better. Yeah, I know what to do. Things up for good. The wings can get in safely. Oh. This is our chance to capture that star destroyer. If we take the bridge, we'll have access to its internal systems. Stand for a breach point, so we can send in a boarding team. You're up five. Breaching a star destroyer, just like the old days. All right. Look out, Vanguard! We got a gunny story incoming. I hasn't heard it. Sure. Just tell me when I can turn my gun. No good. Imperial fighters incoming. Go. Oh. Did I get it? No, I don't think I finished the scan. Shit. Can't finish the fucking scan. I got fucking fighters all over me. Oh shit, that's not good. Taking damage. They won't do to me. Let's keep looking. I have no shields. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right in the ass. Oh, we gotta destroy it. Yeah, dog, I got it. Why don't you just shut the fuck up and let me do my job? God damn it. Yikes, yikes, yikes! Now, push those last fighters back. Clear the sky. <laughs> that was a bad idea. <laughs> These Imperials just keep coming. Oh! Get off of me! Everybody power to shields. Oh. That'll leave a mark. I frisked. I blew that one up. Interceptors on me. Can't oh. Five. Help him out. I'm in a real bind here. 
Where are you at, Frisk? Come on, Frisk. Hold on, dog. I actually like Frisk. Oh, dog, that was sick! Where's the other one, Frisk? I got him, Frisk. I got him. Got your ass, dog. Ion, watch this. Fuck you. You bitch. Pass me on that sucked. Oh, that one sucks, didn't it? Yo, this takes so much fucking concentration. This guy's about to get fucked. Watch. First we shoot that eye on and then we fucking take him out. That's it. You take him out. What? Where's our boy at? Oh, he's over here. He's on top. There he is. Morning team. We have you on our sights. Ready to take on a Star Destroyer? Copy, Captain Antilles. Just get us there and we'll do the rest. You heard him back on. Yo, imagine being so shit that you guys lose a Star Destroyer. How funny is that? Star Destroyer's crew. If our boarding party takes the bridge, they'll slice internal security systems. The crew won't be a problem with no computer access and all the blast doors locked. We've got an Imperial carrier. They're launching reinforcements. They're not giving up the Victoria without a fight. Vanguard. Take down that cruiser. Gotcha, Doc. Advanced targeting. By defaulting, your targeting systems will cycle through objectives, but you can change that with the targeting. Well, for instance, you can set your targeting to flagship systems to focus on the uh, subsystem. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yada, 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 yada. Uh, five for the targeting wheel. Target attackers. It's five. What? Oh. Whoa, 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 what the fuck? I guess just no Enemies locked on to me. Get off of me! Yep, we're hit. 
Beep boop. Do something. I don't pay you to sit around, dog. I didn't mean to click that one. Dude, that was so sick, dude. This thing's so fucking cool. Where's he at? This way? Yeah. There he is. Bro, that's so sick, dude, how they fly in formation with you. On me, Vanguard. Let's regroup at the Victorum. The boarding team might need support. We're almost through those blast doors. Dude, literally though, like, imagine being this, like, supposed to be this almighty military. We've got another Imperial carrier. Oh, fuck, of course. Oh, fuck. Got three carriers. That's a lot. Get ready, everyone. They're fucking pissed, dude. We only got five, five. We're in. Taking control now. We're about to get fucked. Wait, what? Star Destroyer's taken down its own carrier. What a sight. Yes, the ship is ours. I probably shouldn't have shot down most of the fucking Project lasers, Starbuck though. has a Star Destroyer. Huh. Yikes. You can take it from here, my guard. I'll escort Talos Group to safe harbor. Great work. General Sedula will be impressed. That was actually a really fun mission. It was kind of quick though, but I like that one. That one was good. Oh. <clears throat> Alright guys. Uh, I'm trying to do each episode as its like own mission, so um, I will catch you guys in the next episode if you guys are enjoying the series. And then uh, please, you know, drop a like and comment what you guys think I can do better. Um, and then I really appreciate you guys watching. Thanks so much, uh, especially today or yesterday. We uh, we we got a lot of a lot of subscribers in one day, and that was. That was amazing for only being three day old channel. So um, thank you guys so much. I appreciate it. And uh, until next time, see you guys. Peace. <laughs>